It is Saturday. It is Saturday. Never streamed on a weekend before. Unless I'm wrong, which I don't think I am. I think it's the first time. Saturday stream. How are you guys? How's your weekend? Tell me all about it. Yeah, happy Saturday, everybody. Hey, Ali Engdahl was able to join up. It's Saturday, Cass. Welcome back, Aslin, Anconina, this old key, Mandy, Mr. Curry, Vicky. I love Dragon in Space, Tegan, Bianca. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> yeah, hello, everybody. Hey, hey, Trulla, Trulla der Berksberg. I'm not sure if I remember that name. Have you been on the streams before? Have you? Let me know. I'm not sure I remember the name Trulla or Trulla der Berksberg. <laughs> and you totally are remembering the Instagram post right away too, right? Oh, you have been. Okay, all right. Welcome back then. Uh, yeah, the thing is this. I had a plan. I was like... Oh, I'm gonna get out in the shed a bit early and I'm gonna uh, post the Instagram post like right before I go live but then I had some problems getting the the perfect angle of the of the top-down camera and uh, by the time I was done with that I was like okay what time is it and it was three minutes until it was time to go live and I was like and I'm now locked in my phone into the, the stand up here. So I was like, I, I don't have time to do the post. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to do the post while you guys wait, as usual. <laughs> Big dum dum. Tech issues before the stream don't count. <laughs> Let's go, Andika. Glad to see you here. Okay, cast on grocery shopping and laundry. This is my reward. Nice. You've had a productive day then. You've done like the. You've done the boring bits. You're done with that. Now it's just time to chill. Hell yeah. This stream is always perfection. <sighs> you said it, I didn't. It'd be weird if I said it, but when you say it, I'll take it. <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> it is a long weekend. Hey, Vera Crow, hello. Do you have John with you today as well? It's, yeah, what, what makes this weekend long? Are you bored? Or wait, is it, it is a long weekend. Like, do you have um, uh, bank holidays or red days of work uh, on Monday or, or the Friday or something? Hey, I love watching this. Well, thank you, Dragon and Space. I love having you over. <laughs> hey, let's see, let's see. I wish we had a long weekend. Yeah. Oh, in Canada and US, it's a long weekend. Oh, God. We call, what do you call those days that are normally work days that you take off? In the UK, they're called bank holidays. What's it called in, in your countries? In Sweden, it's called a red day. <laughs> uh, no, John is very intensely playing Halo and I'm sewing. That's cool. I'll see John another time. Oh, Vicky doesn't have a long weekend, bruh. In the US, we just call them holidays. Okay, okay. It's not a stream if you were not watch if we if we were not watching your posts on Instagram, Jonas. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, well, if it's what you guys want, I mean, I don't have any problems. Uh, <laughs> never figuring out my structure. You know, I'll happily just be unstructured. Uh, NQ1. In Germany, it's a long weekend too because of carnival season or Fashing Faschnacht in German. And we call those days Brückentag. I don't know if I said that the right. Brückentag? Brückentag. Brückentag! Bridge day. Yeah. I work all weekend and a holiday. Ah, sheesh. Damn, Leanne. That's rough. Go Germany! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I haven't seen Joel in a long time. Um, I can I can say this Joel is working on a video. I Can I can tell you that much there is a video coming 
so uh, yeah, there, I don't know exactly what day or whatever, but he's working on a video. I've helped him a little bit with some elements. Uh, there's definitely a video coming on the Rumi official channel um, in not too far away of a future. <clears throat> well, you're on the wrong channel then. <laughs> oh, Hole 4, Hearts of Iron 4. Oh, I thought, I thought you misspelled Halo. Sorry about that. Hole 4, Hearts of Iron 4. My bad. When is the Wasp video coming out? Um... I'm still hoping to release it this month, but like very close to the end. I've gotten a little bit delayed because uh, I've had to take on some freelance work. You boys, uh, you boy gotta <laughs> gotta pay for uh, rent and uh, food, etc. Uh, so um, I and th th it just got a bit intense there for for like a week and a half or so. So I didn't do much progress on the video there. But uh, yeah, it, I'm hoping to still release it uh, in February. I'm working on it. It's coming. <laughs> on Monday, next week. <laughs> shed payment due. Need to pay for the beloved shed. Yeah, exactly. The The rent for the shed is just crazy, you know? Our boy needs more patrons. Well, actually, you brought the patrons up. I just want to say thank you so much for those of you that uh, joined my Patreon. Uh, yesterday... I uh, finally launched a Patreon and I've said it before on stream and I'll say it again just watching my streams and my videos is more than enough uh, but if you do want to support more directly I have now started a Patreon there's a link in the description but please don't feel pressure to do that I'm more than happy for you to just watch my videos like that helps me as well and watch my streams yeah you don't need to feel any pressure to uh, to pledge on Patreon, but if you want to, if you have the money to spend and you want to support uh, me making more silly animations, you can. The link is in the description, and you get some uh, cool exclusive perks uh, in return. So yeah, if you're interested, you can check it out. But yes, thank you so much for all of those that have already signed up. the The top tier is already sold out, <laughs> which I did not expect. So a lot of uh, a lot of uh, a lot of juicy booty tier people here right now. Uh, thank you so much for signing up and uh, Everybody that signed up honestly regardless of the tier, uh, but yeah, I guess we're gonna have some uh, Juicy booty game nights uh, soon <laughs> The patron is hecka lit gang. Yeah, you <laughs> it's so good it's such a good patron <laughs> But yeah, yeah, don't feel pressure uh, I'm more than happy uh, that you're just watching that's absolutely fine. But yeah, uh, let's see. It's daytime where I uh, where I am. Eleven o eight a.m. That's nice. So you're in um, you're west of here then. You're 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 in like North or South America then, I assume. That's cool. But yeah, um, for those of you that didn't catch the last stream. We started building this Gunpla model. And uh, just as a quick refresh, a Gunpla is a model kit of a Gundam. And a Gundam is a mecha suit from the anime show Gundam. And there's an absolute shit ton of those shows. There's a bunch of parallel universes. It's been going on for 40 years. It's kind of like Star Trek. But anime, there's an absolute crazy amount of different series and different universes. Uh, but yeah, uh, that's called Gundam. But when it's a model kit of one of the mecha suits from that universe, that's called a Gunpla. So this is a Gunpla model kit. And we started building this last stream. And we got the head and the arms and the torso put together. And uh, it's pretty cool. It's something that I've gotten really into uh, the last year. Uh, I really like it. It's basically, it comes on these sprues, right? This is called a runner and a sprue. Uh, just like any typical model kit, you know, like those classic airplane kits or whatever. But the difference is you don't need any glue and you don't need to paint them because everything's already color separated. So all you need to do is cut out the pieces and click them together and you get this model kit that has articulations and you can like pose them in different ways and it's freaking awesome. I have, here's a finished model kit. 
uh, which I have, which I post in this post and I put it on a display stand, which I think is really awesome and really fun. And we're gonna be continue building on this one. Hopefully we can finish it today, that would be sick. But maybe we'll have too good of a time and we'll chat too much and maybe we won't quite finish it. But that's cool, but we'll try. Oh wow, I love this kit. Yeah, I mean, it's sick, it's so awesome. Like, it's such a good hobby and there's like, there's something for everyone. There are uh, different levels and different uh, price points. Uh, this kit is a great kit, but it, it was only like $14, so it's not that expensive, you know? Um, and I have a couple of kits that are nine, ten dollars each. And then you can also go bigger, more complex. The kit that I just showed you, this kit is in a higher grade. It's a bit larger, a bit more detailed. This kit was, yeah, sixty dollars. I bought it stupidly enough on Amazon Prime without knowing there were better places to buy it. So I paid about a hundred dollars, which I have now realized that that was very stupid. This kit is available in, uh, at the right places for about fifty, sixty dollars. Uh, but yeah, there's all kinds of uh, kits in all kinds of different price points and it's awesome. If you're interested in trying it out yourself, I have a link in the bottom of my description. It's not an affiliate link or anything like that. It's just a link to a Gumpla Wiki page where they've listed the best like online stores to buy from depending on where you are in the world. So if you're interested, you can check that out. <laughs> Don't lose any bits. Yeah, I'll try, Bianca. I uh, I did lose. I my favorite kit that I have. I lost the face shield, so I I finished the kit, but the face plate is gone, <laughs> which sucks. <laughs> it should be an affiliate link, Jonas. Um, yeah. Well, I can't be bothered. <laughs> I hate money. I don't want to have an affiliate link. In fact, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna delete Patreon right now. No, uh, I mean, yeah, maybe in the future I can figure something like that out. But I just wanted to uh, put something up there for because people were asking about it. <laughs> Colors look like it's uh, almost magenta pink, kind of, but purple and looks like almost pink, but it's not. Yeah. <laughs> um, to me, looking at it with my eyes and not to the camera's color, this is very clearly purple to me. Um... But I mean, to be fair, it does have a bit of, you know, magenta pink vibes in there. God damn it, it's impossible to tell what color this is. It's a beautiful color. Uh, but yeah. So, we're gonna continue building this. But before we do that... Uh, I think it's magenta. Don't delete my juicy booty status, I cry. No, I'm, I'm not gonna delete Patreon. <laughs> To achieve my dream of being able to do my silly animations full time within a reasonable time frame, I uh, very much uh, appreciate the support on Patreon. It really, really helps uh, to make more frequent videos. So I'm really happy about it. So I'm happy for those of you that that's, uh, have been pledging on there and supporting. That's awesome. Uh, I won't delete your juicy booty status. <laughs> You're gonna get there, thank you. I, I hope so, I'm, I'm gonna work really hard this year, 2023. I've, regardless of Patreon support or not, like I've already taken uh, steps to spend more time. Like I'm working a lot less. Like I have less money, but it's a choice because uh, I'm putting my energy into this. Because um, this is what I really want to do. And I'm really happy about it, to be completely honest. I'm very, very happy about spending more focused time on making my videos and my animations. And now the stream and the community that we built over on the Discord is so much fun. I assume most of you guys here are on the Discord, but if you're not, uh, if you're not, uh, check the Discord uh, out. It's free. Um, there's a link in the description for that as well. It's a really cool community where we're chatting all day. It's, uh, it's nice. Looks like a Japanese version of Transformers, yes. Uh, but I'm pretty sure Gundam actually came before Transformers. They came about the same time. I think there's a bit of a... Some people say Transformers was first, some people say Gundam was first. I think it's one of those cases where it's like, mm, one of them was technically released beforehand, but one of them had like, uh, you know, uh, started the, the project several years before the other one or whatever. I don't, I don't know, like, but... They're, they're, they're quite similar. 
But the big difference is that Gundam are not uh, super robots, as they're called. They're not robots that are sentient creatures, uh, like Transformers. Because Transformers is a specific race that comes from a planet. Like, they are robots, but they... They exist and have their own actions and their own thoughts and stuff, right? Whereas Gundam is mecha suits piloted by people. So in the anime, there will be a person in here piloting this. So that's that's the, the main difference. And also, even though some Gundams can transform, not all of them can. It's not the main thing. Whereas Transformers, that's the whole thing. That they transform into different vehicles and stuff, right? I feel Gundam started earlier than Transformers. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it did, but I think some people... There's a bit... I think there's a bit of a debate on it, where it's like, oh, which one was first? But I, I think Gundam was first. Uh, yeah, Bianca, yeah, we exchange pet pictures. Yeah, we, we do exchange some uh, juicy, cute pet pictures on the Discord server. It's a good time. There's Optimus Prime, like Optimus Prime's brother, Magenta, Miss Prime. Yeah, and funnily enough, the, the original Gundam from the original Gundam TV show is also very similar to Optimus Prime in design. Let me let me show you actually. Um, let's see. It's the RX seventy two dash two Gundam. Uh, and it looks quite similar to Optimus Prime in some ways. I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, that, hang on. I wasn't ready. <laughs> I'm supposed to have the studio mode so I can see what I do beforehand. There we go, let's see. Yeah, 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 okay, so. Here we go. This is the OG original Gundam. And it's kind of similar to Optimus Prime. I mean, Optimus Prime is obviously like uh, original cartoon. It's obviously like um, a truck, but you know, I, I feel like they're kind of similar. They have the same kind of color scheme, blue, white, red. Uh, RX 72-2. Yeah, they're, they're, they are pretty similar, which is kind of funny. Uh, but yeah. Let's see. <laughs> they have the same color scheme, kind of. Oh, you beat me to it. Yeah. Uh, okay. But I think it's uh, time to, uh, to get started. Let's build... Uh, let's do it like this. We'll build one limb, and then we'll take a GeoGuessr pause and do a round of GeoGuessr. Right? I think that'll be... I think that'll be great. Let's get building, yeah, Bianca. <laughs> We're gonna go. We're gonna go. Don't you worry. Uh, okay. I am like Optimus Prime. Literally looks like when Optimus Prime had a brother with pink shoulder pads and pink stuff that literally looked like when Optimus Prime had a... <laughs> I don't know what to make of that sentence. That is a very wordy sentence. But... <laughs> I guess this is Optimus Prime's sister, in a way. <laughs> uh, but yeah. So, what we need to do is put this little bad boy to the side for now. Take out the runners again. Whack out the instruction manual, which is kind of like an IKEA instruction manual. Uh, but in my opinion, better. And then we'll get started. We'll continue the build. I said this last stream, but I'll say it again. I personally like to sort these kind of in alphabetical order because these runners have uh, names on them, right? So if I zoom in here, this is the A runner and there's a B runner and a C runner and a D runner, etc. Uh, so I just like to kind of structure it by kind of putting them in alphabetical, alphabetical order. So yeah, we have the A runner there, we have the B runner. We got the C runner, the D runner, and I guess the E runner. Yeah, the E runner over here. So, IKEA instructions aren't that bad. No, I know. I mean, I, I find IKEA instructions pretty clear. 
Uh, I think the instructions in Gundam, uh, in, in Gunpla model kits are really good. Like, honestly, like, if you are interested but you're worried about the complexity, it's not difficult. Like, the only thing it takes is time, but it's very easy to understand. Like, the instructions are very clear, it's easy to get into it, and... Uh, yeah, there are different complexity in grades. So yeah, if you if you if you want to try it out, just go with an entry grade kit or an or a high grade kit uh, to start off with, and you'll be fine. <laughs> oh shit! Instagram story. God damn it. <laughs> okay, okay, fine. We'll do the Instagram story. <laughs> Let me turn up the beats. Let me get the juicy music on and then we'll post an Instagram story. <laughs> I am such a silly sausage. I think so too, Bianca. He's ready to start the plan. No! We'll post the Instagram. We need to get the Instagram people in here. <laughs> okay, it won't be long. But it will be, certainly it'll be longer than if you guys were trying to post an Instagram story because I am famously slow at this. Okay, I've uh, downloaded the thumbnail. I'm gonna narrate this. This is super exciting. I'm gonna narrate as I'm posting this Instagram story. It's oh, it's so entertaining, isn't it? You 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 you're just in awe. You're like, wow. Okay, yeah. I'm opening. I've now opened the Instagram story thingy. I've chosen the picture. Now I'm gonna write the text. Live. Uh, hang on. Building. Okay, but spell correctly. Building Gunpla Model Kit Live Right. God, the spelling. Right now. Yeah. Change the color to red. Because that's epic. Everybody likes red. And now we just need the link. So I'm just gonna get the link to the stream. I saw that someone said they just posted their first pet picture on the server. That's awesome. Welcome to the server. Okay, I got the link, it's copied. Now I just need to add the link sticker. What's up? Now we just need to open the camera thingy again. Yeah. Hell yeah. Turning the music down a bit again then. <laughs> Let's see if the story actually adds any people. Who knows? Maybe people on Instagram are tired of my uh, Instagram stories now. I feel like the people that are interested in the streams are mostly here and on the server already. So maybe, maybe it's just pointless. But you know what? You gotta try. You gotta try at least. <laughs> uh, why do his marketing... <laughs> we do his marketing analysis for him. Yeah. Please observe, guys. Let me know. 27 before post. Okay, let's see. Oh yeah, Jonas, your arms must be sore uh, like that from our workout. Yeah, me and Bianca worked out earlier today. Uh, pretty intense arm and leg workouts and just yeah holding out my arms doing that was kind of tough <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Maybe up your selfie game to entice your followers to join mm, fair enough. So instead of like the The thumbnail picture I'll have a picture of me be like mm, mm. I'll, be like, I'll be like dabbing It's gonna be people are gonna be so exciting. 
I mean, it's a good point. Maybe, you know, a face is better. Maybe I should just take a photo of myself and be like, Hey, I'm live. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> More risks, yeah. <laughs> okay. However, let's get back to what everybody's waiting for. <laughs> or what I'm waiting for, at least. Okay, so... We'll continue here. We're gonna work on the... Feet first, apparently. Right. So what I like to do is... We'll do the feet sec section, which is this section here. I like to just cut out all the parts in a section in one go. Clean them up and then put them together in one go. Instead of just cutting out these two parts, putting them together, then cutting out these three parts, putting them together, then cutting out these parts. Because that's kind of back and forth and it's not super effective. <laughs> Do we want people in the gang who can only be caught with thirst traps? That's true. Maybe we don't. Maybe we... Maybe we purposefully want to do really shitty Instagram stories and like make it difficult to want to join so that we know it's only the, the true the true enthusiasts are coming in. No thirst people. <laughs> okay, so uh, mostly parts from the bee runner. So I'll get the bee runner out. I'll get my tools out. I didn't mention this yet in this stream, but all you need really to do this is a model kit nipper, which is the same as any normal tool nipper, but with the difference that it's flush on one side. A normal tool one, if I have one. Uh, whatever, I don't need to show you. You know what tools look like. They don't, they're not flush on one side. The, the ones you normally have, like cutting cables and whatever. <laughs> but yeah, that's all you need, however. I like to use a hobby knife as well to clean off some of the excess plastic that gets left after the cut. And you can also use some files to make it even prettier. Uh, but we're gonna not do that too much. Putting the stickers there. But I'll put it here in case. So yeah, just a, a, model, a hobby knife and a model kit nipper and that's all you need. Right, so let's get these parts on the B runner. So we need... 21 and 16 here. <laughs> and then all of these have, you can't see it on the camera, I think, but you see these little squares? Those have numbers on them. So that's how you know which uh, which part you're cutting out. Mm -mm -mm. 16 over, where's 16, bro? Yo. Oh, there we go. Oh, and it's two of each, apparently, yeah. Okay, cool. So I'm cutting out both of the 16s then, because there's two of them. And what else? 21. Uh, 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 uh. 21 here, okay. We'll cut out both of those. Is the, the volume of the music okay? Just checking. Oh, I forgot to cut this one. Okay, well, it snapped off anyways. It's fine. That's good. Uh, so we got the 21 and 16, now we need 22 and 15, right? Just cutting these then. <clears throat> what are your plans after the stream? What are you gonna do with the rest of your Saturday? I'm used uh, to that too. My first name is Nayeli, which is very uncommon here, and I've seen every spelling on the planet. Oh, yeah, yeah, because you're talking about uh, the Ottoman, Ottoman or Bianca. Uh, <laughs> spell, yeah. Otman is, can be a bit uh, difficult. Mellow Knight. Oh, yeah, in Sweden it's uh, Melody Festivalen. The, the Swedish uh, pre-selections for to decide who we're gonna send to the Eurovision is on. Yeah, completely forgot about that. 
I just watch the Eurovision nowadays. I don't bother watching the Swedish one. But it's probably also because I don't live in Sweden anymore, so... I don't really... I'm not meeting up with, with friends that are expecting to see it. Uh, 15, we need two of these ones, so 15. We're up to heat number three, yeah. Sweden is really serious about like Eurovision and, and our own version of it, where we select who to send to Eurovision. Most countries just have like one competition, like one night of uh, to select who's gonna represent and that's it. Sweden does like, I don't know, six weeks of it. <laughs> Like, they're really serious about it. They're like, we're gonna send the best, we're gonna find the best for the best. It's also to make more money, I guess. They, it, from the very beginning, back in the day, it was only like one TV show, one night to select the winner. But over the years, it's become more and more uh, different heats. Kind of like a tournament, kind of like, a, you know, the World Cups or something in football. Oh, uh, Aubrey, you're gonna work today? Sheesh. Yeah, Jonas is British now. Today, my dad and I are going to attempt to get me a new phone. He's convinced he can negotiate a better price. And while he's very good at negotiating, I don't have much faith in him getting the phone. Yeah, I don't think like large tech companies are gonna be like, all right, I'll do you, I'll do you a deal. We'll see, if he pulls it off though, he's a legend. Let us know. <laughs> I'm probably gonna take a nap later today. My health app says I didn't sleep all day Thursday or Friday, and that's probably not good. Yeah, that's not good. You should take a nap. You should probably take more than a nap. You should take a full, full-blown like sleeping session <laughs> I uh, let's see what is the new video called I don't know what the new video is called for Joel's YouTube channel uh, I mean I don't know the title of it either and uh, it's not out yet so I mean I don't want to to spoil what it's about or whatever but um, it should be coming soon ish I don't know exactly when but he's working on something I can I can say that Vicky's is gonna chill then stream later tonight. Oh yeah, me and Vicky is actually gonna stream together next weekend, uh, playing some Demio, which is my favorite game. Really epic. It's gonna be cool. Uh, I will update later for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Petra and what's his name? Ah uh, yeah, it's gonna be fun. AF yeah. Can I play too? I don't know. You have to ask Vicky. She's the what? She's the She's the host of the stream. Uh, let's see. I lost my train of thought. I cut out the 22 and the 15, I think. No, I didn't cut out the 15 yet. You guys are just too gosh damn interesting. I'm getting sidetracked. I've got to build this kit. <laughs> and yeah, once we built the first leg, We'll, uh, we'll do a uh, Geogaster pass. It's gonna be sweet. Yeah, if four people can play, yeah then. Okay, so I guess uh, Gods and Heroes will play as well. That's, that'll be sweet. Uh, right, we got the 15 and 22. Yeah, so now we just need uh, B24 and then C13. That's it for that part. Uh, 24, 24, where are you, little boy? Why, are you, son? Here you are. <laughs> and then we need one from the C runner. C13, right. Two of them actually, because it's two of each piece for this, because the both feet are the same. I've already converted some people on the Discord server to uh, to to get into Gunpla. Vicky actually finished her first model kit yesterday, I think, uh, which is awesome. Um, My brother is out with my dad in the car thing where my little brother and my dad are looking at cars. That's my brother's birthday present. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, you don't have to answer about your age if you don't want to. That's fine. Uh, let's see. I got the parts right. So now that I cut out all the relevant parts, uh, what I will do now is I will go over them again. Because if you can see here, ah, I purposefully cut them not completely flush. Because if you cut them completely flush immediately, you can end up with like white discoloration stress marks in the plastic, which is not epic. So typically they recommend you to cut it a bit away and then go in with a second cut or with a knife or something like that. And I like to use the knife at this stage. So I'm just gonna quickly go over, uh, go over these parts, cut off the excess little bits and then uh, plop them together. And I know on stream it looks like I'm literally cutting in towards my thumb, but my thumb is on a completely different level. So when I cut out here, I'm nowhere near my, my thumb, but yeah. Uh, I'm not saying this is the best way to cut. I mean, in a perfect world, you always want to cut away from you, but you have very little control over something this small when you do that. So I do cut towards me, but I, I keep it on a completely different height level. <laughs> you cut out some people in my family cut potatoes. Yeah, I mean I mean that's kind of that kind of is how you cut potatoes though, isn't it? My grandma very Swedish definitely cut potatoes like that. Yeah, no, I mean Bianca was just asking you like if she doesn't or if he or she doesn't want to answer They don't have to it's just a question. It's all right. It's cool. Uh, <clears throat> and then if you're if you're like really taking your time, every some some people like every single piece they like go over and like sand them and stuff. I'm not that bothered, especially because I might in the future actually custom paint this kit. I might change the colors of it. Because I'm personally actually not the biggest fan of the color. Uh, and there's no point in like getting super fancy at this stage. But once you put it all together, even though you can see imperfections when you look at the pieces like up close, when you put it all together, honestly, you don't really see it. You don't notice it. So it's not, it's not really that essential. Oh, actually, I just realized. I'm gonna do what I did last stream. I'm gonna use one of these small boxes to put like the clean parts in so that I know which ones I've, uh, I've gone through. No, I cut away. They tried to teach me the other way, but it never stopped. <laughs> Let's see. Wouldn't it have been easier to spray paint the purple slash pink uh, like trays? I don't know what to call them before cut. Yeah, okay, so yes, if you wanted to change the color of a kit, you could just spray paint the entire runner, right? But the problem is when you do that, once you cut them out, you end up with all of these spots where the original color comes through. So that's not very good. I mean, I guess afterwards you can touch up with like a little brush or something, but the proper way to do it by the people that are really into customizing them is like you cut them all out, you clean them up, you sand them, you make them real nice, prep them for priming and then you paint the individual pieces and whatnot. But I mean, yeah, some people do it with the runners and they just accept that like you, you will have little imperfections because you then cut in the painted parts. Hey, Xerius, what's up? And Stian Moog Stod, what's going on? Very nice. Hey, glad to see you back. How the analytics squad? Can you report? Was there a difference at all after the Instagram post? I feel like I 
done quite a lot of these posts so i suppose the people that are interested might have already just subscribed to the channel or joined the discord so maybe i don't need to do the instagram posts anymore maybe it's uh, unnecessary a few came in all right maybe next time we'll try a thirst thirst selfie just to see the difference just to see what happens <laughs> Or not. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try and speed this up a little bit. Just, I'm, I'm anxious, not anxious, but I'm, uh, I'm pumped to put these. I want to put them together. Impatient is the word I'm looking for, not anxious. Uh, I feel like it would be easier to just touch up later what you need than trying to paint after or like I'm guessing mass painting all the pieces of the kind of amount touching up prior to assembling. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely easier for sure, but you get the best results uh, by prepping them so you only have to go over with the paint once, especially if you do spray painting, because then when you come in with a brush, you're going to get a different texture, right? And if you're going to spray paint it again to touch it up, then you might as well have just cut them all out beforehand anyways. Uh, but yeah, you can do it that way. And some people don't spray paint at all, they just use brushes to hand paint them and... Uh, and that's, you can do that too, for sure. I've never customized anything yet, I have never painted, but I want to try it out. Which is one of the reasons why I got some of the more entry grade more affordable kits because if i mess it up which i probably will because it's my first time trying it out it's not gonna like be too painful because it's like i will have messed up a ten dollar kit and not like a sixty dollar kit you know that that'll be that wouldn't be so super fun <laughs> yeah that's what i was saying in the second part oh okay yeah fair enough Uh, 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 let's see. I think you should use yourself instead. Yeah, I'll, I'll try with just a picture of me next time, for sure. That might that might actually be a lot better. I didn't even think about that beforehand. Okay, we're getting there. We're gonna be able to put together the feet soon, which is gonna be super exciting. Okay, one last piece to clean up and then we can click them together. Okay. And let's put the lid back on the hobby knife. Safety first, you know. Except we're still gonna cut towards ourselves later. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, someone said, let's see, I have to live vicariously through y'all because I have the worst coordination, so doing this would be a struggle uh, rather than a fun hobby. And then uh, Mr. Curry, me too, Christina, far better to watch someone do it than to struggle. That's fair enough. That's fair enough. <laughs> yeah, because Instagram is all about real people. Yeah, I think you're right. I think you're right. I think it's a lot better if I do that from now on. I will. You have changed my mind. I will do it. Okay. Right, we'll get the part out. Oof, not, let's not drop them or lose them. Okay, so we need to find this part. I'm pretty sure, yeah, it's this part. Goes with this part, yes. Yeah, clicks in here. Let's see if we get a good click. Yesterday we got some lovely clicks. Let's see. I don't know. I'm holding it up to the microphone, to be clear. I don't think that was a very loud click. Yeah, looks about right. This picture is matching up. I'm looking at this and this. Uh, now we just need to do another one of those. Right. 
linked. There we go. Cool, we got those. So we have now made two of these in this area. So now we'll do this. Hmm. Okay, yeah, it's this part that we just put together, together with this part, but you have to consider the orientation it says, and this is the orientation. I think this is gonna be a click. Let's, let's do it. I think that was more of a creak. And then this goes into here. Oh yeah. Right, so we got that. Now we'll do the same with this one here. The exact same type of thing. Put together the exact same type of way. And finally, aha. Sometimes in the instructions you get this. What you have to do in a certain order. So here we need to put the purple part on this part first, and then we put it together with this part. So we'll do that. <clears throat> Wait, where the fuck? What piece is this? <laughs> did I cut out a piece that wasn't supposed to be cut out? I think I did. Oh, I can see this piece is for the next segment. I'll, I'll just keep that for now. Right, so we'll take this, we'll take this. Yeah, like that. Like that, and then we just plop them in. There we go. Hell yeah. What's going on? We got the feet! Woo! <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Two out of ten click. Yeah, it was a bad click. Oh, I don't let my pets in my room. That's how I can do puzzles. Yeah. Oh, Jonas, did you swear? Oh, did I swear? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Smart about pets staying far, far away. Yeah, yeah. So, like, if I built inside the house a couple of times and our cat, he just loves getting in there and be like, <laughs> He ruins the vibe. You gotta slowly build up to good clicks. Yeah, I'm giving you two out of ten clicks, but we'll be getting to the ten out of ten clicks. It's gonna be, uh, gonna be crazy. It's gonna be crazy. Right. Let's finish the right leg and then we'll do a, a round of GeoGuessr, it's gonna be epic. Mr. Curry, so sorry, something came up here. I'll have to leave and watch it back tomorrow. Have a great night all. That's all right. Glad that you could join for a bit and uh, yeah, watch it back later if you want. Uh, see ya. Bye, Mr. Curry. Let me just, let me, let me check something real quick. Wrong computer. Just give me a sec. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cass, I just saw that um, you signed up for Patreon. Thank you very much. Arigato, Cass. You're a ledge. Very nice, thank you. Uh, just noticed the music stopped. Yeah, it was just in between songs. Yeah. <laughs> Arigatou gozaimasu! <laughs> Need to support the shed man. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. Now I can stay in the shed for another day. <laughs> okay, so... Actually... Let me zoom in a little bit more. I feel like we have a lot of space around here that's not necessarily needed. I think I'll, I'll zoom in the camera a little bit. Even the, the resolution will go down slightly, but whatever. Uh, I think it just makes it a bit easier to see, scale-wise. 
something like that, I think, is good. Let's see, where are my hands? Yeah, maybe I'll put, put it a bit to the right. Yeah, something like that. No, you don't pronounce the U at the end, it's just mas. Okay, uh, so it's Arigatou gozaimasu. So it's not gozaimasu. <laughs> I'm not Japanese, I don't know. <laughs> Clearly I need to watch more anime. I've, I've watched a lot of anime, but uh, I thought I uh, picked up some of the standard phrases, but clearly I got that one wrong. But hey, I can say sayonara. Itadakimasu! <laughs> uh, and uh, like they say in uh, in uh, One Piece, where they're like, Uruwa, Luffy, kaisukure! <laughs> I think that means, my name is Luffy, I'm a pirate. I think. <laughs> Japanese lessons with chat, hell yeah. Okay, okay, so what do we need to cut out? We need some stuff from this. Uh, we need a lot from the sea runner, so let's cut out the, the sea parts first. And now it's not twi two of each part, it's just the one part. So we need 16, 14, 19, 21. 16, 14, 19, 21. Okay, let's go. 16 Oh and 14 is up here so let's let's cut on this side while we have it and 19 is here so let's cut on that gotta be effective with turning turning around you know don't wanna don't wanna over exert myself 21 is here Be bad. Let's say what people said. Uh, you can't pronounce the U at the end. It's just very common to admit it. Oh yeah, Andika Tan is actually quite good at Japanese. He's he uh, has actually helped me. I am potentially doing a Japanese voiceover thing to uh, for one part in the Wasp video, and he's he's helped me translate some stuff. I haven't recorded it yet, but I'm gonna try and uh, mimic his pronunciation and get it. I might not use it, I might just use like a JoJo audio and just add my own subtitles, but uh, I'll do a version of it at least and see if it works. It could be funny. <laughs> that would be funny. So yeah, thank you for helping me with that. Let's see. Okay, so we got those parts. What else? We need stuff from the Bee Runner. Cool, put this one back. Oh, I flipped that one over there. What do we need? 23 we need. Conveniently, it was right where I first looked. I guess I'm a natural. I'm just drawn to the right piece immediately, you know? Okay. 23, 17 we need. Mm, yeah, that's here. Then we need eight and ten. Oh, ten is the one that I accidentally cut out before. So we got ten here, which is already cleaned up by the way, so I'll put that back. And then we need twelve. That's it for that page. Put this back. Let's see. Exterior, so Suki becomes Ski. Natsuki, huh? A fellow abroad in Japan, Japan viewer. 
Uh, sorry, it's just my friend being silly. Yes, and yes, yes, it does. Okay, okay. Yeah, Japanese. And I, I do know what I do know about Japanese is like there's a lot of things that change uh, depending on the gender and uh, how close you are to, to someone. Like they have all the endings of like the word. Like uh, if it's like I don't know, like Sakura San, Sakura Chan, Sakura whatever. Like there are different Chan San. Uh, and so depending if like you kind of have a crush on them if they're your friend uh, If they're like your elder or whatever like the, there's different ways to address names, which is quite complex <laughs> I don't know why I'm teaching you guys because I barely know about it someone else in the chat can explain it But there's stuff like that. I do know that <laughs> Maybe I should start a tutorial where I'm like you get like the the shitty Probably a bit wrong version and I take credit for it and then other people just come in and like now nah, well It's technically this <laughs> And I'll be like hey, hey, I'm teaching you Japanese Bow before my language expertise I Have noticed though in periods when I watch a lot of anime which uh, I haven't watched a lot of anime the last few years but when I watched anime really intensely there are times when I'll read the subtitles before they've said the line and in my mind I'm just like I'm, I'm feeling it like I'm, I'm saying it the right way that they then say it in Japanese like because at some point I've heard someone else said that thing and I get the translation right and I'm just like ah I know stuff <laughs> and then immediately after on the next example I get it wrong but uh, you know there's that moment that short brief sweet moment of glory that I appreciate when that happens when you feel like you know Okay, we got that part. Oh yeah, and right now we kind of have Asian sounding lo-fi beats, so I guess that suits the conversation. And also we are building a Japanese model kit after all, aren't we? It's something about the scale they're using, right? I don't remember what it's called. I should know because I'm a musician, but uh that makes it sound like the Asian scales or whatever in the melody. I just don't know the name. But it's basically if you play only the black keys on a piano, you kind of have the scale that makes it sound Asian. Uh, I just start. I just casually started doing some Swedish a couple of days ago just because, and it's a lot, but, but I also kind of love it. Yeah, Bianca has. Um, she's been sneakily improving her Swedish quite a lot. She understands way more than I think she does. Uh, but the speaking and reading is harder, right? But yeah, she understands Swedish surprisingly, surprisingly well. Asian scales aren't necessarily just that. Asian scales, yes, that's the name. Yeah, no, I mean, like anything in music, there's like more complexity. But at a, at a, to, to sound like that stereotypical Asian scale, so to speak, you can play those keys and it kind of sounds like that. But there's obviously more. That's not like the summary of all of Asia's music, you know? Uh, let's see here. I feel like the hobby knife is like really dull today, even though I, I ch swapped to a fresh blade um, last stream, so it shouldn't be, but it, it, it does feel kind of dull, I have to say. It's not really cutting as well as I was expecting. Oh, you'll be using Duolingo then. <laughs> yeah, I know those lines anyway, yeah. Let's see. 
soon ready to put this this stage together. And then I think we just have a couple of more pieces on the next page, and then we have finished the leg. And we'll have our first pause. Geo gets a break. But honestly, yeah, I, I, I've said this before, but I want to say it again. Thank you so much for everybody that's been watching the streams. Because um, when I started streaming, to be completely honest, I was very much expecting to, for a good while, stream and maybe there wouldn't be any people watching at some points. Maybe there'd be like two people, three people, five people sometimes, you know. Uh, but I've just been really blown away and pleasantly surprised that like there's been so many people watching and it's made it really really fun for me so i'm really happy uh, uh about you guys watching the streams and your support and it's uh, making me more motivated to keep making fun content and i have a lot of fun exciting ideas for the streams in the future i just don't want to put too much time figuring some of that stuff out yet because i really want to get the wasp video done I need to remember that like my main thing is I want to get more videos out. But I have a lot of fun ideas for what I could do with this stream that I am gonna get to. But yeah, I'm just really, really happy for all you guys' support watching the stream. It's really, really fun. You've made it such a great experience for me. <laughs> it's been a pleasure to be here. Oh, well, thank you, Vicky. My first intro introduction to Swedish was when I watched the OG Girl White Dragon Tattoo films. Ah, yeah, it's good. I know, uh, not a stereotype, but I know there are definitely uh, in like North America and stuff like people that are hesitant to watch foreign foreign language films and TV shows. But well, there's so many great uh, TV shows from different countries that like it's not difficult for Europeans because we've grown up watching a lot of you know, American stuff, because America produces a lot of great stuff. So we're used to watching things with subtitles. I mean, some countries do a lot of overdubs. But Sweden, for example, never overdubs stuff, and it's always subtitled. So we're used to that. So for me, it's never been weird to watch, like, a Polish movie with subtitles, or a Danish movie, or a Spanish movie, or whatever. And there's just so many great things out there. And I, yeah, and I just think, yeah, don't be limited. Uh, to only want to watch like English stuff like get used to watching with subtitles and there's so many awesome things out there Let's see Okay Right, let's put this stage together then Right, so first thing is this part Which is gonna have this little this little bugger plopping in here Apparently oh that's slaughtering quite nicely. That's what I, I just love that these kits are so well engineered that you can just literally put things together and just by the perfect uh, precision and tolerances, it will stay in place. No glue or anything. Like sometimes when you put too much force on something, yeah, it, it will snap apart and you have to click it back together. But in general, it's just crazy that it, like you end up with a, a model kit that you can move and pose and it holds their poses from something that you haven't even glued together. It's literally just like snap fit. It's crazy how they become so good at it. They've done these kits for like 40 years and they've come a long way since the beginning. The, the original kits were not this good, uh, but it's, it's just crazy how good they become at creating these kits. Right, so next part is just this chungus of a, of a piece, we'll click it together. Let's see if we get a click. Ooh, that was a nice creak at least. I like that. Hey, is August in? What's up? I thought it was GeoGuessr. We're soon heading into a GeoGuessr pause, August. If you hang around, we'll do a round of GeoGuessr. It'll be sick. Uh, uh, so yeah, yeah. If you hang around, we'll do a round of GeoGuessr in probably 10 minutes or something. Right, so next part. Looks like this part doesn't matter what orientation, you literally just... Yeah, it's the same. It's mirrored. You just put it in. Boop. And then we got this and this, right. 
that part and that part goes together like this Woo! so fun <laughs> me trying to make like model kit building entertaining <laughs> Woo! Ah! <laughs> like the action the action is intense okay let's see if we can get another satisfying click into the microphone oh i could hear that from here through my headphones that was dope that's a good click like it if you're down August, you can, um, when it's time for GeoGuessr, you can hop on the stream on a video call uh, while we do uh, a round of GeoGuessr and then, and then you can piss off because I'm going to continue building. <laughs> if you're down, you're more than welcome. I'm lying in bed. Okay, okay. You don't have the, you don't have the camera and stuff. That's fine. You can just silently play with us. I will say though, I have a plan. I've spoken to Rickard, fellow Rumi team member, and he is most likely gonna guest uh, one of the streams next week, which will be fun. So uh, if you wanna get some Rickard action, uh, you are gonna get it next week. Okay, yeah, we, we literally just have this row here of parts. It's just actually two parts that I need to cut out. And then I've finished uh, the first leg. And then that's a perfect time to do a GeoGuessr pause. So B14 and B13. So we get the, the B runner out. 13 and 14, right. Let's get it. It's mucked in here as well. Wait, it's mucked in here? There's Big Mike in the chat. Where is he? I don't see him. Hey, Martin, what's up? I have... Uh, I've been planting seeds in my... Martin is my cousin, who also uh, has been working in the roomy team. Um, I'll be planting seeds. I know that he's gonna love this, building these kits. I just know it. I know, you know, we're, 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 we're finally tuned together. We're blood related. I just know he's gonna love this. So I've been like planting little seeds. I'll be like, buy the kits, Martin. And he's be like, I don't want to spend the money, Jonas. I'll be like, buy the kits, Martin. And uh, maybe next time I go to Sweden, we can buy, uh, build the kit together. That'll be fun. <laughs> That's something I've been looking forward to. I know, Martin, I know that you're gonna absolutely love this. And when we sit down and build our first kit together, you're gonna be like, Man, why didn't we build these kits earlier? Why the fuck didn't you convince me earlier? Sorry for swearing, by the way, I forgot. Uh, and then I'm gonna be like, I told you, I told you, boy, I was trying to get you on. That's how, that's exactly how it's gonna go down. Mark my words. Uh, okay, I think that's... Fine, let's put these bad boys together. Right, so apparently here, there's gonna be a little click fit. So let's see if we get a nice click in the microphone again. Ah, pretty nice, pretty nice. And then you need to bend it back. Oh, I fucked that up. Sorry for swearing again, Jesus. Uh, and then you put this piece in which doesn't matter the orientation. Slide it in here. Nice. Like a glove! My original joke definitely did not steal that from Jim Carrey. Sue me. Don't at me. No, don't sue me. Just don't at me. <laughs> Do not sue me. <laughs> and then we stretch it out again. 
Wait, 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 wait. Oh no, I put it on backwards. No, <laughs> I put it on backwards. That's why it was being a bit wonky. Okay, okay. I failed, I failed. Okay, right, this is the order. This is the order. Right, hang on, hang on, hang on. Right, this part needs to come out. This part needs to be like this. I think I did that off camera, sorry. And then this part goes back in here. Yeah, and now, now we're cooking with gas. Now we're, uh, now we're on the roll. Yeah, 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 this is what it's supposed to look like. Slide that in, get it back like that. Hell yeah. And what do we have here? Ah, oh, this part goes here. Oof, very nice. And then we take one of the feet. Let's see if we get a click. Ah, something. All right. I believe, I believe. Oh, damn, I didn't even realize we have this kind of uh, action going on there. Wait, hang on, is this right? Yeah. Oh, is that the toe? Oh, I thought, I thought that was the toe. I think this is the toe. Yeah, that's the toe. Okay, cool. We finished the leg. Hell yeah. And uh, let's not forget we have the, the torso and the, 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 the head and the arms and stuff. But yeah, we finished the leg. Hell yeah. Yes, it's a leg. And now, as promised, after finishing a limb, we are gonna do a GeoGuessr pause. We're gonna have a, a round of GeoGuessr. August and Martin, are you still here? You still down for round of GeoGuessr? Oh, oh, oh yeah, Marcus, Marcus in chat, hell yeah. Welcome back. The stream seem laggy here, I can't chat properly. Hmm. Geo intermission, let's go. I just need to uh, put away some of the stuff momentarily, I just realized. <laughs> uh, just give me a sec, because I need to have my keyboard out. <laughs> but that will take a second. There's not that many things to put away. There we go. Look, look how quickly. Now we went from model kit to gaming. We're ready to game. How, how swift was that? That was insane. What's, what uh, must be your Wi-Fi then? What's glitchy on your end? Is it the, there's a delay from writing and chat and it showing up on screen? Because if that's what it is, then that's the same for everyone. If it's just a laggy frame rate, uh, then it's probably on your end. Keyboard stream, let's go! Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Speed typing, yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna prep a Geogas around. By the way, August, I didn't look if you responded. Are, do you want to be on call uh, for, for the stream? Uh, for the Geogas around? E even if you don't have camera or, or, or no. Martin is welcome to come on call if you want to during the GeoGuessr round. Yeah, you can be on call. Cool. Martin, do you want to join in on a call on stream? Just voice. For the GeoGuessr round. I'm having a guess soon, bro. Okay, that's cool. No, Martin, we'll just have, we'll settle for August. Jesus. <laughs> okay, I have a room up. Uh, I'm posting a link, I'm pinning it in the, the top of the chat. Uh, 
there's no limit, like there's uh, up to 100 people can join. So obviously anybody that's watching that wants to join can join. So yeah, just click the link in and get in. <clears throat> uh, I'm just gonna prep it so that we can actually see the game. There we go, got the game open, August is in, hell yeah, then I'm gonna... Then I'm gonna get him on a call. <laughs> Can you guys hear August or is it not routed properly? Can you hear him? Say something, you fool. Okay, cool. Uh, then I need to just have a look at that real quick. Just give me a second. <coughs> Speak. Oh, okay, so you were there, but it's very low, okay. Uh, I think I need to put you on B2. Speak. Hello. B2. Oh, uh. Yeah. But uh, but now I hear myself back, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, uh, not anymore. Okay, that's good. Yeah, 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 do you not hear yourself back anymore? <laughs> yeah. No. Well, a little bit, but it doesn't matter. It's okay. It's totally okay. Do you think like I do, B2? Haha. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so funny. Okay, so you guys can hear. Can you hear him uh, at a good volume? Uh, uh, compared Am to me? I at a good volume? August. Hello, everyone. Hello. Someone says I think August has a cold. Yeah. Uh, or Mark <laughs> says that. Uh, no, I don't have a cold. I'm just lying down in bed. I'm just sounding a bit lazy. You just be. You're just in goblin mode. <laughs> yes. Vicky, yeah. you can tell yourself that you're Cindy. <laughs> so yeah, yeah, if you want to play, get in. There's only three people in here. Let's go. Let's get some peeps. Come on. <laughs> more people, more yeah, people. Come on, Do people. A guesser, do a guesser. Come on, come GeoGuessr. On. GeoGuessr is actually really, really fun. Yeah, it's and a fun game. And you know what's game. really good about GeoGuessr? What? Is that if you feel a little bit insecure, not for us, Jonas, yeah, yeah. but for other people, yeah, if you feel a bit relate. insecure, uh, you can uh, join uh, under a pseudonym. So <laughs> people don't know. Just give As opposed to every other uh, game where you were forced legally to use your real name, there are no gamer tags uh, in other games, only GeoGuessr. So GeoGuessr is the one... Your one-stop shop, the one chance to be anonymous on the internet. <laughs> Sorry, Jonas, I didn't hear that. That's okay, I was just kind of uh, making fun of you. It's fine. <laughs> nice. nice, that's good. That's good. <laughs> yes, my legal name is Gods and Heroes. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if it's like first name Godson here and then last name Rose. Rose. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Godson and the E is, is, is and the middle, Rose. It's the middle less letter. So it's ah, Godson oh, yeah. E and then Rose. <laughs> Godson, Godson E Rose. <laughs> I yeah. wonder what's the nickname then? Is it like a uh, Gaudy? Godi, Godso, God Godros, yeah. Godros, God, <laughs> Godros, God, God, just Gods, yeah. Uh, oh, Gods, oh, with a Z, it should be a Z. Yeah, Gods, gods. yeah. <laughs> the fact that you're analyzing that so deeply is amazing. What can I say? We're intellectual guys, you know. That's why you're coming oh, to this yes. stream to get the big brain thoughts. 
No one else could analyze I... a name like that. It's just us. <laughs> it is fun to analyze things, though. It is. It is. Me, me, and Larissa, we were on today. We were analyzing. I don't know. Have you seen White Lotus, Jonas? Uh, what? Yeah, we we started watching it, but to be completely honest, we uh, we felt like it was trying to be too many different genres, so we kind of got tired after a couple of episodes, and we didn't continue. Are you joking with me? It's like the best show I've ever seen. It's amazing. Mm. Too I many mean, genres. It's comedy thriller. Yeah. I guess so, but it wasn't like, it's also like satire and like, sometimes yeah. it's kind of ha-ha funny, but most of the times it's really like, it's 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 like back burner, very discreetly funny and just awkward and like just quiet. Yeah, <laughs> that's it's like Ru a Ruben Östlund movie in a series. Yeah, it's true. It's very Ruben Östlund to be fair. Um... It's, yeah, I mean, I, maybe, I maybe, we'll, maybe we'll it's, pick it up again. To be honest, we only have two more episodes to go. Uh, we it's were like, so... Yeah. It's on the first season, or... Because second one's good, too. Yeah, oh, there's a second season? Yeah, it, it, I, I, I think White Lotus is probably the most... The most groundbreaking show that mm. I've right. seen. Bold claim. For, for Don't care time. for it. Let's go. Do you get some? I, th I think it's the Twin Peaks of <laughs> of this year, this age. It's too late. If you didn't enjoy it, it's too late. We're going. <laughs> Jennifer Coolidge. It's iconic in it. Yeah, she is. Two minutes on the clock, everybody. Let's figure it out. Let's figure out where we are, using only our wits, brains, and maybe cheating Google on the side. Uh, right. Gorditas Tonis. Oh, I know where that is. <laughs> Good old Tonys. Man. <laughs> oh, that's my Nan's house. This is very Swedish. Um... <laughs> I don't know if it's because I have crappy UK internet, but I feel like GeoGuessr is always super low frame rate and sluggish when you move. Is it snappy for you? What do you mean, snappy? It's like moving one frame at a time. No, but like right when you click, it kind of does like a little zoom kind of thing. And that yeah. zoom is oh, yeah, like three frames per second. Yeah, it's pretty, sh it's, it's pretty shitty. Yeah, okay. Then it's, it's not just me. Nan. <laughs> you started using British terms, even I don't say nan. Uh, yeah. God, I'm not even taking it in. I'm getting too distracted by... Uh, what do you mean? Nan, British term. What do you mean, Nan? Yeah, is, in isn't what? isn't Nan? Don't you say that in the U.S. and Canada and stuff? You I don't... say both. Or you mean Nan as in grandmother? Yeah. Uh, that's both. That's all. Uh, yeah, both U.K. right and North America, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It's me Nan's Nan. house. <laughs> it's me Nan's house. Yeah. yeah. Me Nan. Oh, but it's okay. it's only it's only the maternal grandmother, correct? Yeah. yeah, I don't know, I don't know, I don't have time, August. I need to place a guess. I have no freaking idea where we are. I'm a hundred percent. Oh really? Yeah, I, I haven't oh, taken that's anything too in. Too bad. I haven't taken anything in. Yeah, I I knew it. I knew it was like the completely different side of the world. Why did I pick Spain? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I thought you were trying to none. <laughs> <laughs> 12 points I got. Can you beat it, August? I doubt it. Okay, 3,476 points. points. Okay, I mean... <laughs> Okay, let's do next round. Okay, this time I'm gonna use big brain. I only used 5% of my brain last time. Interesting. I'm seeing words. Oh. Okay. Hang on. Let's... See. Okay, ba -ba 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 -ba. calm down. I mean... I see... different things that tell me different things. <laughs> which which thing is the right thing? That's very. Uh, I don't want to tip you off, August. I don't want to let you in on my big brain move. Uh, 
I mean... I mean... I'm pretty sure we're like in the US or something like that. But at the same time, the road name was very kind of Spanish looking, but everything else is in English. Aha! 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 Or, or, or was it not Spanish? Was it once again the, the French things tricking me? I see, I see, I see, I see what's going on. Don't try and trick me. Okay, okay. Let's, let's, let's lock it in. Let's lock it in. I'm feeling it. It's over here. This is exactly right. <laughs> I've locked my gas sandwich, I'm whatever. I'm a little bit confused. Oh! Oh! I freaking know where... Oh my god. Come on. Uh... No! Uh... Why? Why couldn't it just be the French part of Canada? Why did it have to be over there? I saw French. I saw... I saw Gibsons right at the end, and then I realized that's like right off of, that's like by the islands in uh but i but I, why couldn't it just be quebec yeah. it was french bro there's more there's more french in canada than quebec no uh, i mean clearly there are but i mean in my in my emotionally i will i want to say no <laughs> I saw Bank of Montreal, but that was way off, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, this is my favorite, when they drop you off at a really small road, kind of in the do middle of nowhere. I love it. Do you know that by the... Uh, on the islands, uh, by Vancouver, yeah. um, in BC there, there's a town called Lund. Like, uh -huh. uh, like uh, named after the Swedish town, oh, Lund. Lund, okay. Yeah. All right. Tell that to someone who gives a shit. Why don't you <laughs> smell your own bum? <laughs> why? Why? Why don't? Why do they do this to us? Why? Why? Why do they do this? Oh, hang on. There was a sign. What the hell? I've I've like zoomed out my or zoomed in on the wrong Whoa. spot in my browser. No. So I, now I can't see anything. How do I? How the hell do I fix that? Uh, con hold control and scroll, or, or command or scroll on Mac, or al alt or scroll, or option or scroll, or whatever it's called. One of those. Nothing's keys. working. Okay, well then, uh, I guess you're just gonna have to have VW. To Can I update the... <laughs> I just... No! Uh, I... Are you out? I refreshed. <laughs> I refreshed, but I... I can't... I can't see any of the graphics. Oh! August, look. Will you just tell me where Saint Augustine is? No, because I, uh, this is really frustrating. No, but I don't care. Just help me instead. Where Saint Saint What's Augustine? Going on? <laughs> I don't know. I'm feeling I'm feeling South America here. Let's go. Uh, I don't know. Let's go Paraguay. Oh. Yeah, let's go. But this is. Why can't I see anything? <laughs> yari yari yari. <laughs> no! <laughs> Why? I am so <sighs> bad today. What the actual hell? That was not even remotely close. That was... <sighs> Have you figured it out? Yeah, I, well, I, the problem was I couldn't, I couldn't zoom out because I had nothing except for the Google Maps thing yeah. to focus on. So I could... So that's why. I, oh. oh, put the nut there. <laughs> hey, you. That was frustrating. Yeah, I bet it was. I bet it was. Okay, hang on. Immediately. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm oh, oh, oh. No, I saw a website, but I was like, ah, oh, but it's just a dot com. Bastards. <laughs> Bastards! Why do they have to be all international? Mr. Worldwide. Here's another dot com. When I find a freaking uh, web address, I expect it to be country specific. Otherwise, what's the point? Mm -hmm. 
I mean, definitely Spanish or Portuguese, for sure. But uh, that doesn't necessarily narrow it down. Couldn't, couldn't they just give me a web address? Is that too much to ask? Clearly. Hmm. Give me a sign. <laughs> okay, just me. I thought that was funny. Whatever. Be a hater. No, I, sorry, I'm not listening to you. Ah, fair enough. <laughs> Bianca can relate. To not listening to yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> ah, fuck it. <laughs> I'm just going to Spain. Whatever. I feel like I've seen garbage containers like this in Valencia. Ooh! Uh, Ooh! 4,947 points. What's up? Madrid. Yo, what's up? Wait, you were... Wait, round result? Yeah, you were... <laughs> I was better than you this round. <laughs> yeah, you were. Oh my god, get wrecked. Absolutely pathetic. It was uh, a bit outside Madrid in Spain. Okay, is this the last round? Yeah, this is the last round. Can I come in? Can I clutch the win? Can I clutch the win? Hey, Phoenix! I don't think you were in from the start. I don't know when you came in, but welcome. <laughs> I thought I thought you revealed what what, what plays it was. <laughs> hey, Phoenix! <laughs> Oh man. Hmm. Oh, uh, I have no idea. I just, I just, I have no clue, man. Do you know? Uh, uh no. Nah. We'll see, we'll see. Ah. Oh. No, what the fuck? I cheated and I was still so far away. No! <laughs> <laughs> What's the What point? do you mean cheated? <laughs> I saw a sign that was like, oh, Monumental Carlo de blah blah, and I was just like, I just googled it. <laughs> and, <laughs> and I thought I was really close. <laughs> and I was I was on the wrong, I mean, I'm, I am close, but I was on the wrong side of the, of the bay or whatever. Not, well, it's bigger than a bay this, I guess, but. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, second place that round. Uh, six overall. Uh, so yeah, I mean, Marione Lamy won, very good, very epic. Vera Crow very, very often nice. plays as well, very cool. Siri Pling, third, August, nowhere to be seen on the podium, <laughs> as expected, not even close. Uh, um, yeah. <laughs> hell yeah. Let's do one, since we weren't that many playing anyways, why don't we do one round of countries? Because uh, it's like max sure. 10 people or something, and then I'll get back to building. <laughs> yeah. Good job, everybody. Good job, everybody. Right. Uh, I'm going to have to start a new game mode, I think. I'm going to have to close this down. I think. Let's see. 
Let me just get back here for now while I set it up. Oh, there's a team duel mode. That could be cool. No, 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 no. I want to play private. Come on, bro. Party. Start a new party. Countries. Right, so there's max 10 players in this mode. Uh, I think we were around 10. But yeah, if you want to get in, click this new link that I'm pinning right now. Get in quick if you want to get in. Oh yeah, I should have sent it to you August uh, 1st, but yeah, you got no, it. No, I, I did it. I did it, man. I was, I was on it. Yeah, you were on it. That's cool. <laughs> so, Marioni says normally they suck, but now they won. Yeah. Very good. Oh, is John? Is John in the chat now? Yeah, John, John Demon is in the chat. Hell yeah. You should play the game again with Joel. Yeah, I mean, if Joel... No! Uh, something unexpected happened. Hang on. Did it shut down my room? No, I'm back in. I'm back in. Uh, right, let's see. Yeah, I mean, if Joel comes on a stream in the future, which I'm sure he will at some point, yeah, we'll, we'll play some Duke, yes sir? For sure. I think we're full. I think we're 10 people in the lobby now. We are. Okay, let me explain how this mode works. Uh, we've done it once before on stream. Uh, the way it works is, first of all, it's a battle royale thing, which means uh, you, you knock out opponents until it's just one winner left. Every round, some uh, one, two, uh, one or several people will get knocked out. And the only thing that matters in this game mode is getting the right country. It doesn't, you, you don't need to be as close as possible or anything. You just need to be within the country, place you guess. And uh, you have several guesses. Uh, let's see my setting. We have three lives. I'll give, I'll, I'll give it four lives. You have four lives. So you have four tries to get the country. But it's not four lives per round. It's four lives for all the rounds. So you want to not, you don't want to waste them. Uh, so it's either right or wrong, but the thing is this, you can see what other people have guessed, so other people's incorrect guesses, they will start showing up in the corner, so if you play it cool and you see like, oh, someone already guessed France and that was wrong, so I'm not gonna waste a guess on France. So you can do that as well. But then there are superpowers as well. So there's the 50-50 superpower and the spy superpower. 50-50, if you have no freaking idea where you are at all, you can press 50-50 and it will show you two countries. One of them is the right one, one of them is wrong. And you need to pick the right one and then you're through. Spy, I think, is you wait until someone has gotten the right answer and then you can use spy and you can just spy on their answer and you know for sure that you can take that answer. But you only have one of these superpowers uh, each. So, yeah, that's it. Oh, someone dropped out. Okay, one spot opened up if uh, someone wants to come in. No, no, I mean, you still, you're still looking, um, you don't need to know flags, per se. You, you, you're still looking around like normal. You, you're looking around and you place your guess like normal on the map. You don't have to know the flags. Okay. No, I guess you do have to know the flags to see the guesses. Whatever. Okay. We're full. Come Let's on. Let's go. One minute, 30 seconds on the clock. Four lives. Let's go. Good luck. Battle Royale. Battle Royale! Ah. Okay, so in the first round, everybody can make it, technically. There are 10 spots. 10 spots to get through. Uh, okay, this is just... This isn't giving me anything. Oh, August got it. Okay. Yeah. Calm down with the flexing. <laughs> ah, okay. Okay. I think I, I think I got it. Woo! <clears throat> I got it. Okay, going into spectate. All right. So someone will, uh, went for Netherlands, or is it France? No, I think it's Netherlands, but that was wrong. No, no, that's the Netherlands. That was a good guess. That's that was what I was that I thought first. Yeah. Okay, three people left. 30 seconds left, four lives each. Oh, you can do it. It's only uh, Noopy left. You can get it. You can get it. Come on. Use your superpower if you're not sure. Or just get eliminated. Ooh, Rocket! Superpower! Superpower! Come on! 
Noopy! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Will you get it? Will you get it? Did, did you get in? No. Ah, uh, too bad. Too bad. Oh. What is? Okay. Oh, it's doing that thing again where it's doing super tiny hops. That's super annoying. Like, even if I click far, far away, it's just hopping one click. Okay, now it's doing better. Uh. Oh, you went India? You fool. Yeah. Clearly not India. Pathetic. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm, you know what, I'm gonna place a guess. That was wrong. <laughs> you thought it was Poland? No, it was Indonesia. Oh, Indonesia. Yeah. You fool. Oh, okay. I see some symbols. Oh, man. Why can't I remember what alphabet this is? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna need to use my uh, superpower here. Yes! I got it! Yeah. Got it! The tension is rising, okay. I, I, did, I did superpower too. <laughs> yeah, I've lost my 50-50. Um, right, only have spy now. But I'm not sure spy actually does work like I thought it did because it's disappeared after oh. people put their correct guess in. Ah, oh, Cass is out. Cass is out. Vera, a usual power play is oh, out. Oh, maybe, maybe spy means that you're actually like looking at the person while they are walking around to find out what they're going to guess or something. But that feels like worthless. Like, like you're... Sp <laughs> depends, depends who, who you're spying on. I can't find anything. No. I found one sign, but that didn't really tell me much. There was one sign, right? Oh, now I ended up at the end of the road. Great. I mean... I'll place a guess. Fuck it. Oh, that was wrong. Ooh, someone got it! Really? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to risk it, you know? I'm gonna have to... Nope. Nope. What is it? Where is it? Oh no. Like, I'm pretty sure I know the continent, but I, that doesn't really help me. No! No, where is it? Oh, <sighs> South Africa. Yep. Uh. Okay, let's see who will who will take the win. It's uh, John Demon oh. versus Marioni Lamy. I'm gonna have a look around to see uh, yeah. to see if I can I would have, to get a feel. I can I can tell you that I would have known this. No palm trees in Canada. No, I'm mean, fair, but I was panicking. I mean. I mean. Yeah, I would get this. I mean, there, there are like three, four countries that it could possibly be here. But I mean, I feel like I, I would narrow it Wh down. What? Which four? There nah. are two countries. Yeah, well, I was wrong anyway, it's August, so I'm not going to dive into that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you thought it was German, huh? Or Austria or, or Switzerland. Um, yeah, but I mean or, the language. Yeah. Like, yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, we have a winner. Okay. Marioni Lamy. Hell yeah. Again. Again? Again. You're like... Yo. You said that you weren't good, usually. Yeah. But you've won both. What the hell? You lie! You're... You're... You're, um... Doping. I call doping. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna drop out. Yeah. I'm gonna continue building as well. But, uh, glad you could join. Very epic. Very yeah, cool. it was really fun. It was really fun. Yeah. It was juicy.
Everybody say thank you, August. Don't come back. <coughs> what? <laughs> thank you for having me. Yeah. Uh, and it was very fun to hang out with chat, as always. Yes. Chat is the best. I'm unquestionable, but it chat is. is the best. Oh, you're okay. You know? <laughs> Sometimes. Ah, do we to the full click here? Indeed. Bye bye. Okay. Bye. Dropping out. Bye. Bye. But I ain't going nowhere. Okay. Turn the music a bit up again. Hell yeah. Let's go. Let's continue the model kit building. <laughs> Top down view, we're back. Why did I lose last round? I had Belgium selected and waited to press the button for the last three seconds. Oh, uh, and when you're in the final, uh, whoever hits gets the right answer first wins. So, like, if you're too slow, even if you know the answer, you lose. Uh, so, that, that, that might be why. That's probably what happened. I also ain't going anywhere as my cat has pinned me down. Yeah, that's classic cat. That was handy to know, Omega Lol. Yeah, I mean, I gotta keep some secrets to myself, otherwise I have no no shot. No, I mean, to be honest, I forgot about that. I would have said if I remembered. <laughs> there are, like, I I don't play that mode that much. Uh, so yeah, I don't remember all of the bits. <laughs> but now we know for next time. Now we know for next time. Also, is, uh, is, is LK not here today? Cause she, uh, she got a model kit herself, which is exciting, but I don't know if she couldn't make the stream today. <clears throat> she was earlier, oh, okay. She's building right now, okay, awesome. I mean, if any of you is building, send me pics. I'll show it. Send me pics. Uh, actually, I wanted to. I was going to show something last stream, but I forgot. So I'll show it this time. Uh, let's see. One of the viewers. I don't know if they're here right now, uh, but that doesn't matter. Uh, someone had this let's see uh, 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 uh. and here we go yeah someone on the discord server had shown this, uh, Argen Viper. Uh, watch your live stream. This is the very first Gundam that I put together. The thin white lines are all stickers, which is pretty crazy. Uh, that must have been very fiddly putting on. I don't know if that came with the kit or if the stickers are like custom, customization. This might be customized because I don't know of many kits that are like purple, pinkish, but it, it might not be. And then uh, their husband got jealous, uh, so uh, she uh, or he had to uh, to show his collection as well. So uh, his husband has a lot. Her her husband has a lot of kits. So this is some. Uh, these are some kits that their husband has built. Oh, that's the God Gundam right here. I don't know if you can see my mouse mouse, but uh, I would love that. Over here, on the top left, second to the left. It's a kit called uh, Master Grade Red Frame Astray Kai, which I would love. I would love that kit, it's so cool. It's like samurai design, really awesome. Just wanted to show that. <clears throat> yeah, there we go. This looks nerdy, yeah, it's nerdy. <laughs> it's fun. Okay, 
So, we have torso, head, arms, the right leg, we got the foot for the left one, let's finish the left leg. And then I think we just need a waist and then the, the, the model is done. So let's get on with it. Nerdy but cool, yeah, I mean, it's, it's dope. It's not nerdy in a bad way. Oh, what is Gundam? Never heard of it. Yeah, okay, uh, so yeah, if you just came in... I explained it in the beginning, but basically... Gundam is an anime that's been going on in Japan for 40 plus years. Uh, maybe not 40 plus, but 40-ish years. Uh, it's kind of comparable to Star Trek in the sense that there are many different uh, like timelines and universes within it. And there's an absolute shit ton of episodes, there's several different shows and everything. Um, so Gundam is the anime. And Gunpla is model kits of the mecha suits from the anime. And the thing is this. Uh, in the Gundam universe, what a Gundam is, it's a certain type of... Uh, they call it a mobile suit. So, this is a mobile suit. Like, it's a big mecha that's piloted by a human. This is a mobile suit. But... Only this is a Gundam. This is not a Gundam. So basically all of them are mobile suits, but not all mobile suits are Gundam So the Gundam is a special type of mobile suit, which has like superior technology, it's like better than everyone else's and Typically in these shows, it's always the good guys, the hero, pilots, the Gundam So uh, technically what we're building right now This guy right here it's not a Gundam. It's a mobile suit from the Gundam universe, but it's actually just a mobile suit uh, from one of the bad guys of the most recent anime show. But we did a vote on stream and this is the one that people wanted to see, so this is the one I started to build first. Kind of reminds me of the whole premise of Pacific Rim. Yeah, it, it's quite similar to that, but it's set a lot more in space. It's actually really good. Like the original uh, uh, Gundam anime, it's available on Netflix in most countries in uh, the original show has like 50 episodes or something but they've done uh, they've cut them together condensed it into three movies that are like two three hours long each which is way shorter than watching 50 episodes and they're really good like I really recommend watching it like it's really old school you know 80s or whatever but like so many Japanese things, compared to something like Transformers, it's it, it it's it's not just like a cartoon kid show. It's actually a mature story. It's it's not so you know it's not it's not just like evil versus good. It's much more nuanced than that, and it's these kind of complex political conflicts. It's really interesting. I I really recommend watching the original three compendium movies on Netflix. They're called like Gundam One, Gundam Two, Gundam Three. Uh, they're really dope. Another thing you could do is just hop on Crunchyroll and watch the most recent show, which is called uh, Gundam The Witch from Mercury, which is completely standalone. Uh, I think it's 24 episodes. Uh, it's really, really good. This is, this is from that. I'm so glad I didn't get into Gundam Wing when it was on Cartoon Network, or I'd be so far down that rabbit hole. <laughs> yeah, Gundam Wing was, I think, the first show that really took off in the US. But by then, I think Gundam had already been a thing for like 15, almost 20 years in Japan. Maybe 15 years. Uh, <clears throat> but yeah, let's continue. So, we're just gonna cut off the needed parts. We are not here. Hang on, we, okay, where are we? We're here. On this page. Right. So yeah, I'm gonna do the same thing again. I'm gonna cut out all the pieces relevant uh, to here. I'm gonna do in everything in this zone because that's the left leg. I'm gonna cut out all those pieces, clean them up quickly, and then shoop, click them together. And then we're good. Let's see. I think my husband built one of these. Okay, yeah. I mean, it's, it's, a, big, uh, it's a big hobby. There's a lot of people that are into it. It's really cool. And I've said it before, but I'll say it again. You don't need any glue. It all just snap fits together and uh, it's really dope. Uh, okay, let's go. Let's start with all the parts from the B-Runner. B23. Here we go. Uh, 
I'll do the same thing again where I put the pieces I cut out in this box here uh, so that I don't lose them. 17 we need. Now I've already put together one of the legs. This is the same thing, but just mirrored. So this leg will probably go quicker. Uh, let's see, 17, B, 11. But yeah, how you join this Saturday stream, the very first weekend stream. Because I know there's been some people that haven't really been able to catch uh, the streams on the weekdays because of time zones and whatnot. So I hope that some people that aren't usually able to watch can watch today. Uh, <laughs> wait, what did I just cut out? B17, we need nine and 11. Super chill. Yeah, it's nice since I can chill and watch without having to be at work. Yeah, Vicky usually sneakily watches it while, while at work. <laughs> I usually miss because of my sleep schedule, but I got up for this one. Hell yeah. I'm glad I'm glad that you're here. Very nice. Yeah, I'm enjoying uh, I'm enjoying a bit of a Saturday stream, you know. Uh 9-11. I did I cut out both of them? Let me let me see. Yeah, eleven and nine, yes. So now we need B12. Yes, here we go, B12. And B14 and B13, 13 and 14. Let's see. I think that's all the B parts, so we can put the B runner back. Huh, let's see, what do we do? Let's do the C parts. From the C runner, the purple parts. 17. Let's get it out. And... 15, yeah. And 22 and 20. Over here. Oh, I just, yeah, I don't know why. I just find this kind of thing very relaxing. I find it very ther therapeutic. I like doing little fiddly things, but it's not that fiddly. I mean, but, but this is uh, one of the easy, well, less complex kits. So this is a lot less fiddly than, than some other kits are. But I just, I just find it really relaxing. Right, that's all the C. So we got C, C, B, B. I think that's actually all the parts for the leg. So we just need to clean them up then, and then uh, we can just snap it together pretty quickly. Let's see. Oh, you see, you watch a Nutcracker every year, the weekend after Thanksgiving, nice. Butterbeer is so good. I, I've never tried Butterbeer, I want to try it. I want to try Butterbeer. Has anyone uh, started playing the Hogwarts Legends game? Or Legends of Hogwarts, I don't remember what it's called. I wasn't that interested but i watched some videos of it i watched a, a bit of a playthrough and i was like oh wow this is this is really looking good i was like wow this like basically feels like you're in the movies uh and i'm actually kind of interested in playing it it seems really dope it seems really dope hey <laughs> gods and heroes no why do you do you know like harry potter <laughs> I'm not saying I would play it on stream, uh, necessarily. I just mean I've, I've been thinking of trying it out. It looks so cool, but it's not for Mac. Aubrey, I'm a fellow Mac soul, just like you. 
The only reason I have a PC is because I needed it for work with Joel. Uh, but once I had one at my disposal, it's so nice to be able to play stuff. So get yourself a PC. <laughs> get yourself a, a discounted uh, cheap PC and uh, become a gamer. It's gonna be epic. Let's see. I don't like building things, but I find it relaxing to watch others do it, apparently. My brother's playing Harry Potter game at the moment, and in my opinion, it's really cool. He'd, he's obsessed even though I'm the Harry Potter fan of the two of us, yeah. Yeah. I have 40 hours in Hogwarts, it's so worth it. Oh, you have not lived until you try Butterbeer. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to try it then, aren't I? Gonna try it when I have an opportunity. Where can you even get it? Can you only get it at like... Or like Orlando or like the Harry Potter theme parks and stuff? Or can you get it elsewhere? Tell me. If you can get it elsewhere, I wanna get it ASAP. If you can only get it at Harry Potter place, I still want it. But it won't be at ASAP. Universal Studios. Harry Potter World. Yeah, you can probably have it at Harry Potter World. So, for anyone that's tuned in pretty recently, what I'm doing now, I've cut out the pieces, but you have little, uh, you, get, you can get little marks from this is where I cut it off. There's more excess plastic there, and I'm just kind of cutting it off with a uh, with a model knife or a hobby knife to to get it a bit smoother, so it looks a bit better. And then we'll put the pieces together. I like building, but I just suck at it. Also, Legos are top tier. Yeah, I don't think it's very difficult building these. I think it just takes a bit of patience. So if you're not a patient person, it's probably not for you. But if you are, it's not actually difficult. It just takes a little bit of time. And the fact that you don't need to use glue and it's already colored, like you don't need to fiddle around and be like really good at painting to make it look good or anything. You just literally need to just cut it out and put it together and it will look good. And you don't have to do this stuff with the knife that I'm doing. First of all, a lot of people don't use a knife. They just use a different, uh, like a sharper nipper tool to get those last little bits. Uh, so yeah, you can do it with, with really simple tools. Well, I said it before, but I will say I feel like the knife is weirdly dull, even though it's a fresh blade. Don't know why. Don't know why. Okay, that's the purple parts cleaned up. I used the knife yesterday a few times. It was so nice to clean up the spots. Yeah, I know. It is when you've done it, you're like, oh, worth it. <laughs> okay. Won't be long now until we can snap this leg together, which is gonna be very satisfying. Jonas and Bianca could get it directly from Hogwarts. Yeah, because we're, we're in the source, we're in the UK. <laughs> we're too far south though. Hogwarts and Hogsmeade is uh, in the Scottish Highlands, is it not? I mean, if it's real. The actual Harry Potter world is in London, <laughs> which is not that far away. Butterscotch flavored drink. It's sort of like butterscotch, I think, not beer. Yeah. I 
I mean, it's kind of like root beer, like right? Because root beer isn't actually beer. Okay, that part. Exactly, Jones, exactly. See, I know stuff. I know how to explain things. I mean, this part is going to be hidden, uh, or that part of the part is going to be hidden. So I'm not going to spend too much time on that. Me and Bianca have just started watching yet another very exciting Scandi thriller, by the way. We're very into uh, Nordic crime shows, or th crime thrillers in general. But uh, Scandinavia just knows how to make them really good. Uh, we, we're, uh, I think we're on episode two or on episode three. I don't know. It's very exciting. It's butterscotch meets cream soda. Okay. Man, Swedish ruined me every time I see the word beer. Now I remember it's Earl in Swedish, which means oil in German. And I just, <laughs> yeah, that's not very nice. <laughs> Should we have some Earl? <laughs> Okay, we're getting there, we're getting there. Right, one more piece to clean up and then we can snap this leg together. Hmm, here we go. Put the cap on. Stay safe. <laughs> okay. I just ate a big breakfast and the music is making me sleepy. Well, it's because it's a uh, chill lo-fi. It's it chill vibes. I don't mind if you fall asleep to the stream. It's supposed to be relaxing, you know? <laughs> okay, so we're... Just gonna put them together. Follow the instructions here. This part goes here. Ooh, yeah. Satisfying, satisfying. This part goes here. Do we get a, uh, a creak? Mm. ASMR times. We get a creak. Let's go. And this part goes in here. There we go. And now we take this part and this part goes together like that. Do we get a little bit of a... No, I think that one was qu pretty quiet. It was a more smooth experience. How about this one? Oof, that's a good click. That's a good click. How do you rate that, that click? Come on. You have a lot more patience than me. I am a pretty patient person, to be honest. I think it just it just comes down to whether you find it at its core, whether you find it relaxing or not. Because if you don't find this relaxing, then it's just frustrating, right? And if you find it relaxing, which I do, then you don't really need to be patient because it's 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 a relaxing thing to do. So, but I am pretty patient, I guess. But maybe maybe I don't know. Maybe maybe if you are patient, you find this relaxing, and then. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, let's see. So that part snaps into here. Now this part snaps into here. Last time on the other leg, I got this wrong. So let's not get this wrong this time. I'm pretty sure that's correct. Do we get a click? Yes, we do. Very nice. Right, the order is right, the order is right. I'm looking at this picture here now, right? Yeah, this is correct. Clicking it in. Woo, that was a good click. Bend them. Put this piece in. Uh, 
There we go. And now it says to straighten it out. So we straighten it out. And we put on this bit here. There we go. And finally, this bit here. There we go. And now all of a sudden, we have two legs. But we need the waist part to be able to put them in. So we're gonna have to, to build the waist. That was a good click right there, yeah. What do you say? Do we do do we just do the waist? I think I think let's just do the waist because it's so few parts. Let's get it together and then we'll do some uh, then we'll do a round of geoguesser. Let's get it done. <clears throat> okay. Right, so I'm just gonna do the, the same process again. I'm gonna cut out the parts, clean them up, and snap them together for the waist. And then, uh, then we're good to go. Oh, I didn't even notice before. Uh, look. I didn't even notice that it says which runners a section uses. So here it says it's it's uh, runner B and C. So I, I would have known that immediately if I just looked at that. I didn't even notice that. That's, uh, that's good. So this one needs A, C and B. Okay. Good to know. Good instructions. Right, so we can put away B for now then. We don't need this at this stage. The only thing left on B is the weapon anyways. So, A, C and D we got here. Let's cut out the A pieces first. A20 is first apparently. Where are you, A20? This is A20 right here. Let's get it out. And these pieces that have the nubs, they're gonna click into something. So I'm just cutting these flush immediately because I don't really need to clean this up because you're not gonna see this. So I'm just I'm putting it straight here. Uh, A18, this part is gonna be visible. So we wanna cut a bit further away Let's on this. Right, right, I'm gonna need to clean that up. And what else, what's on the next page? Another A part. A19 we need, yeah. Same thing here, we cut a little bit further away here. There we go, that's all the A parts I believe, yes. I'll put away the A runner for now. Actually, was that all? No, okay, yeah, there's a, a backpack thing here. Uh, we'll do that later. Right, we need... Let's do the C parts. The purple from the C runner. So, 25. There we go. C24. Uh, C26. Yeah. And any more C? Yes, C23. We're getting there, we're getting there. I'm getting excited now, I'm just powering through these. There are like accessories, like the backpack and weapons, which I don't know if we'll build today, but at least the actual suit itself will be done. Maybe we'll build the backpack as well. Cool, and now it's just the D runner. It does look fun to build. It is fun to build, I really recommend it. If you are interested, have a look in the description. There's a link to the Gunpla Wiki where you can see the best places to order from online depending on where you live in the world. And I would recommend to start with a high grade kit or a real grade kit. Because um, then it's not too complex. Uh, and it's not too expensive either. 
this is hard to get a hold of because it's really popular. But if you find this somewhere, this is just like 10 to 15 dollars, uh, which is which is good, I think. <clears throat> Any high grade kit from the most recent show, The Witch from Mercury, are all great. Uh, and those boxes look all like this. They're like white with this blue thing. So if you find a box that looks like this design, it's all from the latest, uh, the most latest show and all of them are really good. Like they're simple, cheap high grade kits, but they're really good and detailed for being high grade kits. <coughs> and despite the high grade, using the word high, it's not the highest grade. High grade is actually kind of the lowest complexity grade. It's high grade, real grade, master grade, perfect grade. Okay, anyways, let's do the D, let's finish the D runner pieces. What do we need? We need one and three, that's it. No, two, two and three, two and three. These pieces right here. There we go. Let's clean them up and put them together. Lol, so not confusing grades at all. No, I know, I know. <laughs> Just a little bit confusing. High grade, mass grade, and perfect grade is like the original grades, but then real grade is like a master grade, but scaled down to be the same size of a high grade, but with the complexity of a master grade. So it's so it's basically high grade, real grade, master grade, perfect grade. And, uh, but a lot of people right now are saying that real grades are like the best kits. The most, like you get complexity, even more complex than some master grade kits, but it's small and uh, pretty affordable. So it's a really good grade to build. <clears throat> but they can get pretty complex. Like there are some really small parts in those kits. It's not difficult, it's the exact same thing, but there's just more parts. Uh, okay, I'm gonna Go a bit with the nipper on some of the parts because some of the parts were really large off cuts like this whole thing and then i'll come in with a knife i do these quiz boxes where you build a box out of wooden pieces and then it's like a locked thing where you have to solve puzzles to open it and the building process seems very similar it's fun that sounds right up my alley as well i love puzzles I love like those little like wooden puzzles and stuff. It's it's uh, so much fun. I just love that kind of thing. Right. I'm getting there, getting there. Okay, that's the biggest pieces cut off now. Let's just go over with the knife. Do you watch Chris Ramsay? Uh, do you mean the comedian Chris Ramsey? Uh, not really. I've seen him in stuff, but I, I haven't really watched him. <clears throat> Put the cleaned up pieces here. Puzzles are amazing. Yeah, I know. Uh, there are. There are. They are really good. I just love kind of teasing my brain with those kind of things. No, there's a YouTube. Oh, Chris Ramsey, the YouTuber. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I watch loads of Chris Ramsey. Yeah. I mi 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 uh, mixed him up. There's a, Chris Ra a British Chris Ramsey comedian, I think. Yeah, Chris Ramsey, the YouTuber. I watch loads of his puzzle videos. Yeah, they're really good. I should have caught him that, I don't know why. I actually watch a lot of that. Maybe lately I haven't watched, watched as much, but I will occasionally still watch him, but a year or two ago I watched like every single video. He is good. He makes very good videos. And I have bought some of the puzzles that he's tried out, like not the expensive ones, but some of the simpler ones, and I really enjoy it. His magic stuff too 
It's great. Yeah, it is. His magic stuff is insane. He's very talented. Let's see. There we go. Only four more pieces to clean up here. We are getting there. Hell yeah. Do you like that I have music on in the streams, by the way? Or would you rather that I don't? Or do you... F like, I, I feel like it maybe adds a nice vibe. But I guess if I don't have music, you can just have your own music on in the background, I suppose. Keep the music. Music awesome. Love the music. Okay, sweet. I like the music too. I like listening to it while I do this, so... Love myself some lo-fi beats. Keep the vibe. Hell yeah. I'm happy to keep the vibe. Okay. That's it for the cleanup of the waste. <laughs> you be careful with that sharp knife. Oh, Craig is in the chat. Hello. Yeah, I am being careful. It, it looks like I'm really close to stabbing myself all the time, but like I'm actually kind of if, if I twist around when I when I do this I'm actually the knife is actually at a completely different height than my thumb. But yeah Jonas used to have a magic channel in the beginning. Yes, I did my very first YouTube channel was a I did the uh, car trick tutorials and I have tried to find that but I just I can't so I think I think I must have deleted it which is a shame because I would have loved to see some of those old tutorial videos they would probably been hilariously bad but uh, yeah unfortunately they're not they're not up there let's see okay let's put it together right so we start with this piece this piece here also by the way Craig how you doing what's up Craig is a, a friend of mine and Bianca's he's about to move to Australia actually which is pretty crazy uh, RIP <laughs> nice to know ya uh, with all the spiders and shit over there <laughs> Can you do some card tricks for us? I haven't done any card tricks for years, so I actually don't really... I don't think I could successfully perform a single card trick, because I don't think I remember them. But I did used to know some cool stuff. Yeah, he'll get eaten by the snake as well. <laughs> I need to use this music as background for my day-to-day -day life. If you like this music, you can, you can just, on Spotify, you can just search for stream beats. Uh, and there are several different playlists by uh, this guy called Harris Heller. He's made uh, he, ha he has a company called Stream Beats, and it's all royalty-free music to use on streams and stuff. Uh, and it's I mean as long as you have Spotify, I mean yeah, it's free to to listen to. It's great. It's a good playlist. You can also just listen to uh, Lo-Fi Girl on YouTube, which is the same type of music but a different company. Lo-Fi Girl also has playlists on Spotify. Okay, let's see. So we need to do this in a certain order. So step one is this. To put this in here. Do we get a click? No, not really. And after we've done that, we can put it on here. That's nice. I just like how nicely the pieces go together. Baby click, yeah. Jack did a car trick on his Jack's Films channel if you want to join us. Oh my god, yeah. Can you do some... Uh, no, I already read that, yeah. 
I just saw the parrot one and I'm in love. Wait, what parrot one? Yes, I think so. We've been getting them. If you do on sale, you order one, you always get tanks out. What's the parrot one? Oh, puzzles. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Yeah, I want to get in on some of those puzzles. But right now, I'm so into the Gundam. So any extra money I have, I want to I wanna buy, uh, you know, the, the gun pockets. Because I really enjoy putting them together. Okay, so we do this part now. Here, we might be getting a nice click. Let's see if we can get a... At least an 8 out of 10 click out of this, that'd be nice. I don't think we will. Nah, that's more of a creak. Let's put together now. I like that like they, they designed them so that you don't just have like an ugly backside. Uh, like the, there's two pieces together, so the back of the piece also has details. I like that. Okay, let's see. These go in here. Nice. Oh, that fits beautifully. And this goes on here. This could be a good click. Let's go. No? Lackluster click. Wait, is this on properly? Yeah, I think so. Okay, so we have these little flappy bits that can move. Let's see. There we go. Now we can actually... We can actually put together... All the limbs, like the body parts for the model. There are accessories that we haven't made yet. But we can actually put together the dude. Which is cool. So let's do that. So apparently... This is the front of it, so we'll put them on like this. Like this. And now we just plop this in here, I guess. Can we get a good click out of this though? Let's see. Nope. I feel like the, all the best clicks are, are over. But that is actually pretty sick. When I first bought this kit, I have to be honest, I didn't particularly like the design. It's just that it was available and, and I wanted something and I thought if I changed the color scheme of this, I would like it a lot more, but it's really grown on me. I actually quite like it. It has a, a cool like chungus stature and we could put it on, hang on. We could put it on a stand and get it into a little bit of a pose. Let's do that. I'm gonna extend the stand leg. Hmm. No, let's get it over here. Right? Stands come separately. Yeah, yeah. The, some of the kits come with stands, but it's usually higher grade kits. Uh, but no, you, ha you have to buy them separately. Bianca got me these for Christmas, which is really awesome. But they're, this, th these stands are, are uh, I think they were like $5 each or something. I don't know. Uh, they're good because they can accommodate several different type of grades and sizes. But there are smaller stands that are more aimed at the smaller kits. And there are like, really cheap you can get like a multi-pack on amazon or whatever for very little money uh, and it's just nice to be able to to get some air poses out of it but yeah it was a super dope gift from bianca very thankful okay uh i just need to change out an adapter here i do have a box with all my little bits in let's see where i put it here it is <clears throat> so we need this part, I believe. I think this is the part that fits in here. Yes, it is. 
yeah, it's the part that fits into one of these grates. So then I just need to plop that part into the square bit here. And we have it on a stand, but let's get this camera, right? Hell yeah, this stand is like very large for this figurine, uh, obviously, but uh, I can make it a bit smaller. No, that was actually as small as it was there. But let's try and get it into somewhat of a fun pose and then let's do a round of you, guesser. Let's see, can we figure it out? Let me... See if we can. Let's kind of pose it like this first and then we'll put it on the stand. It's obviously a quite chunky kit, so some poses you're not gonna like be able to get it into. So I need to think a bit. I'm not the best at posing either. to think I mean, I wouldn't say this is particularly good. <laughs> it's easier when you have like some of the weapons and whatnot, but uh, we have something. Let's swap camera mode. I guess some kind of like flying pose. I don't know, I'm not, that's not great actually. <laughs> but it's something, it's something. But yeah, typically, uh, I think I would I would watch like how some other people have posted and try and uh, copy it. But yeah, we have uh, we have that for now. That's cool. I'm happy about that. Let's let's get him in uh, to his stance, so he can stand. Yeah, we have him back here. You can just stand here for now. Yeah. My kid says 10 out of 10. Hell yeah. <laughs> kid approved. Okay, let's do uh, let's do a round of duel, guesser. Let's go. Okay, yeah, so we got it together. I mean, if you think about it, isn't it quite crazy that like it comes on these things and you cut it out yourself, no glue needed, and you put it together and you get one of these things. I think that's insane. I think that's very cool. I've showed it earlier, but I'll show it again. This is my 
favorite kit that I have now that has all the parts. I really like this one. This one is dope. This is a mass grade Barbatus or Barbatus, Barbatus I think. Really cool kit, I really like this one. Can you play from your phone? I'm pretty sure you can. Pretty sure you can play on your phone. Okay, let me get a round going. We'll do a normal round this time. party there we go and there we go I'm just gonna copy the link so it's the link that I just posted I'm gonna pin it as well at the top so if you want to join uh, just uh, just uh, press the link completely free uh, I think it works on phone as well uh, give it a try Let's see I think it came in black and gray too but I can't remember yeah yeah uh, yeah I think they come in black and clear maybe gray some of them come in white but I don't think these stands do. I'm very happy with the clear ones because it doesn't distract from the model. So I'm very happy about the clear. Whew. Come on, get in, guys. John Demon is in, Cass is in. Both good players, bad banana. Hell yeah. And yeah, even if you're not good at geography, just, just get in, it's okay. I'm not good at this game. Just give it a give it a whirl. Give it a swirl. Give it a swirl. Oh. I can't log in. You can't come in, Cariolora. Uh, some people have uh, had problems with that. Um, I don't know. Yeah, make sure you logged in first and then click the link. Then I think you should be good. I love figuring out what these places are. Yeah, me too. See if maybe it'll need to be reset. Yeah, yeah, see if you can figure it out. See if you can figure it out. get mine to work next time I'll try on my PC but I'm walking my dogs right now okay that's fine uh, you can't play and watch at the same time mmm that's too bad gonna hop off for now have fun Jonas and the shit gang glad that you could join see you another time yeah yeah we'll wait for you you can go get your PC it's fine I'll give you a couple of minutes we good no rush no rush. Ah. It's all good. Let's see.
Da -da 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 -da. Suddenly I realized I'm lying down. Involuntarily chill reaction. <laughs> that's just that's just how these streams are. Ultra chill. You can't help but just adjust to that. Yeah, uh, don't worry about it. I mean, we'll we'll play many more times. If you can't play it now because you're on a phone, uh, that's fine. Uh, you don't have to play this time. We'll just do one round anyways. Um, so yeah, you, you're not missing out on anything massive. I had to step out to teach my six-year-old how to blow up a balloon. No regrets. Did you finish the Gundam? Yes. There are still like... Um, there are still, hang on, there are still accessories that I haven't built, but all the, the limbs and stuff are put together. They're complete. Very epic. And yeah, you can pose it and stuff. I did have a little go, but I didn't really uh, uh, come up with anything uh, very great. So I'm, I need to put a bit more time into that. But yeah, the main uh, gunpla itself is, is done. Hell yeah. How do you make the small screen, Elmeo? What small screen? Oh, the, do you mean on your phone? Yeah, yeah, you just, if you're on iPhone, you just slide the app up a little bit and it like, whoop, becomes a small floating screen on top. I think Androids can do that as well, but I don't know exactly how you do it. I don't have YouTube Premium right now, and I think I can still do the small floaty screen, I think. The sound effect there was 10 out of 10. What sound effect? I don't remember. I do weird sounds all the time. <laughs> okay, so, but Elena Cariolaro, you got your PC you're in. I think, I think it's okay. I think we'll, uh, I think we'll run with this. And uh, and that's fine. We'll play many more times in the future. Okay, let's start the game. Let's see. Oh, three minutes on the clock. To be fair, I kind of need three minutes, so I'm not angry about it. <laughs> oh, we're in a tunnel or something? Why are they starting us in a tunnel? John Demon is going to kill, like, in three minutes. He's uh, very good at this. Cass as well, probably. Let's see. Oh, I'm sorry if someone was still trying to join and I started. Uh, I'm not sharing my screen. Oh my god. How silly of me. Uh, how absolutely silly of me. I'm sorry. I'm a silly, silly boy. Okay. Silly goose, silly sausage, exactly. I need to make a silly sausage emoji for the Discord server. Or sticker. Wait, 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 there was a sign here. Port de Libre. Point de Libre. So, basically, the Freedom Peak. Dangerous. Okay, this is French. They might not have this uh, uh, a recent enough operating system <clears throat> if it's not working. What? I can't go further than this? Yeah, I can. I mean, yes, it's French. Can we actually see something more? It doesn't necessarily mean it's in France. Cuneo. Let, let's just let's just kind of look in France, Monaco area, and see if this we can see a place that's like Muneo. Because this if this looks like a bit more southern France, if it is. 
amongst mountains. So it could be like up here. Let's just place it here for now. Uh, and keep looking. Oh, actually, more signs. Pont de Pien, La, La Roya. Roya. Hmm. You're so silly, Jones. Literally, you're super silly. <laughs> I'm the silliest boy. You've never seen a sillier sausage than me. Uh, okay. Prove on corpse transactions. With my luck, it's not even gonna be in France. It's gonna be like another French speaking region, but this is the best I have, so I'm gonna place my guess. Oh, it's pretty good. It was, uh, I was in the right ish area. John Demon got it, it was closer, of course. Because uh, I can never have a win, can I? <clears throat> but yeah, it was, uh, yeah, it was kind of Monaco, wasn't it? Nice. Yeah, very cool. <clears throat> I have never won too, lol. Yeah, well, you won the round. <clears throat> you won the round. But you know what they say, first place worst, second place best. So, get ready. <laughs> round two, let's go. Oh, okay, we're literally just on a hillside. I mean, okay, there's a lot of pine here. So this could be many places. Why did they drop us here? Is this like on a mountain? This is like a hiking site or something. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. We see the shape of the... That's giving like Asia vibes. That's giving potentially Japan vibes. Let's see if we can find some symbols. This could be many places. Would just be me in a nutshell playing this, yeah. Okay. What do we see? Hey, hey, it's the Google Google car. I uh, hang on, hang on. I mean, the resolution is not letting me look at the signs. I think we're in Asia. Oh, I can. Aha! It's not Japan. It's not Japan. This is more like. Um, yeah, this is more like uh, you know. Kazakhstan or like Mongolia, Kyrgyzstan, Tajikistan, like something like that. Those kind of. I mean, it could also just be Russia. Could also be just Russia, but like East Russia, if it is. Um. I'm just, uh, I feel like, normally I don't share my thoughts like this. Because cause then you can take my thoughts into consideration and your own thoughts and overpower me. But, uh, uh, I mean, it's not really letting me go anywhere else. I'm gonna go, you know, I'm gonna place my guess. I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go Kazakhstan, to be honest. Yeah, but like kind of over here. Let's see what we got. <clears throat> I would have said Mongolia, which means it's probably not that. Yeah, <laughs> I wanted to say Mongolia because it feels like... I thought I was being a bit fancier by saying Kazakhstan, but no, it was Mongolia. I feel like that was a bit too, too obvious. Oh god, I dropped to fourth place. Sheesh. Stian Mugstad uh, won that round. Stian is also in lead. Or Stian, maybe. I don't know. Stian. Okay. Okay. But I'm doing I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. Let's go. Round three. Let's go. I'm gonna I'm gonna be a bit more secret this time. I'm not gonna it looks like Russia. Where are you in the forest in the woods? Yeah. 
I mean, it was Mongolia, which is close to Russia, so... Okay, this blurry thing around the camera here is super annoying. Why is it so big? It must be a different kind of vehicle, a different kind of Google vehicle. I can't go anywhere! What, do I only have this little patch? Can I not go further? Dead ends on both sides. Yeah, what the heck? Maybe I can go this way. Yeah, this is the way. This is the way. No, this is not the way. I, I was here already. Well, this is all we have to go on? Okay, I mean, I have a guess. I get, I get, I get like, I get certain vibes. This is like, mm, this is classical Vietnam uh, dirt. Mm. Okay. I mean, I mean, I don't know. I mean, there's no point in hanging around. I'm just gonna place a guess. Looking at the trees though, I mean, it doesn't look, I don't think it's like as tropical as it could be, right? It could be Vietnam or something like that, but I don't, I think this is more, possibly more South America. I'm gonna go Peru. I'm gonna go Peru. Probably the wrong continent, but whatever. I'm going Peru. <clears throat> I'm going Peru, everybody. You can't stop me. I'm too stupid for this game. <laughs> well, me too. Me too. <laughs> Oh uh, no, it was India, so it was closer to kind of, I was thinking, sure, I was talking Vietnam or whatever. It was, it was, oh, god damn it. I should have trusted my initial instinct. Always when I do that, and then I try and be, be big brain, it always fails. Always. Okay, next round. Next round, yeah. It was India. I was in Peru. <laughs> okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. This gives vibes. Hang on. <laughs> I wonder where we are. <laughs> let's see if we can. Um, let's see if we can narrow down the the area. Let's see if we can narrow it down to like... <sighs> mm. That did not look like India to me, lol. No, but um, it was. <laughs> okay, can we get to... Some road signs, please. Okay, we have something there. Let me... Let me have a look. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put it here for now uh, but keep going oh yeah asking if I was hungry uh, yeah I mean but I'm 
we're wrap wrapping up the stream after this anyway, so I'll just eat. Uh, I'll just eat after the stream is done. I would have loved loved to get like the area more exact, but I wasn't big brain enough. Oh whoa! What the actual heck? What happened here? Whoa! 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 What the? F <laughs> oh, you want? Oh, I'm doing dinner. Okay, yeah, that's fine. I'll <laughs> I'll do dinner then in in a sec. It's okay if you have to go. We're um, we're wrapping up the stream now after this round, anyways. Okay. Yeah, I didn't know where in Chicago it was. It was more central than I thought. Okay. Damn. Fourth in that place, John Demon. Hmm. Okay, final round. Let's go. Okay. Hills. Also a bit Asian looking, I think, maybe. Okay. Are we? Where are we? Cooking stream. Yeah, <laughs> turn into cooking stream. I mean, it's very hilly, but I need to see some symbols, please. Uh-huh. Right. I think... I'm pretty sure I know which country we're in. I just need to... I just need to kind of narrow down the area a bit. I mean, I'm just going to go safe. Ah, of course, when I, when I do go for the capitals, it's not the capitals. And whenever I don't go for the capitals, it's something else. Ankara. Okay. Okay. So, but it was Turkey. Turkey. Yeah. Okay. Hey! First place, Dian Moog starts solid. John Demon, second place. And third place, me! Finally a spot on the podium. Let's go! Elena Cariolaro, uh, fourth place. Cass, fifth. Bad Banana, sixth. Very epic. Good job, everybody. Super nice. 
<laughs> Cass, at least I won a round. Yeah, you did. You did. You did good. Okay. <sighs> what are you holding in that picture? I, uh, I'm holding. Um, I'm holding a parcel from one of my videos, but you, it's cut off. But yeah, it's a, it's a parcel. <laughs> Ankara is the capital of Turkey. Oh, is it? I thought Istanbul was. What the fuck? God, I'm stupid. Oh, well, if I knew that, I would have gone Ankara then. I'm, st I'm, I'm stupid. I'm stupid. But anyways, thanks for joining the stream. We freaking finished the, the main kits of the Gunpla. I don't know if I'll finish the, the um, add-ons like off stream because it's so little or if you want me to do that on stream what do you guys think i'll have to do that another stream obviously uh... <laughs> thanks for trying to help me and thanks for the chill stream Jonas. that's all right yeah everybody's super helpful here thanks for the weekend stream well thank you for coming to the weekend stream gunpla bill was fun well thank you i enjoyed it as well Oh, Ali, you you stuck you stuck around the whole time. I applaud you. I appreciate it. Yeah, for those of you that have stuck around the whole time, you're legends. For those of you that dropped in later, you're also legends. That's cool. Hey, and DK came back just before it ended. Nice. And Mark Taylor's here still. Hell yeah. Mandy's still here. Nice, nice. Who else do we have that's been here from the very beginning of the stream? Come on. Oh, bye, Mark. <laughs> do I sense uh, the room reference there? Hey, Vicky. Whole stream gang. Yeah, Christina as well. Habiba, yeah, this whole key cast. Damn, we got some people. I wasn't. Yeah, John, you're a traitor. You weren't here for the whole stream. What gives? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Vera, Vera was here, yeah. K Kristen, hell yeah, Dory, nice, nice. Well, regardless of if you were here for the whole stream or just for a bit of it, I appreciate all of you equally. Thank you so much for making this so fun. Oh, you're still building, Alke? You have to uh, post an update uh, post on the Discord server. I wanna see, I wanna see. In the creati creativity uh, channel, I wanna see it. I dropped in and out because people in this house claimed there was something more important for me to do than watch the stream, like eating. <laughs> Horrible people. <laughs> and Danielle O'Neill was here. Hell yeah. Yeah, well, as always, it's been an absolute pleasure streaming for you guys, hanging out with you guys, building the Gunpla. Playing some GeoGuessr, it's been really fun, really fantastic. See you guys next week, and happy continued weekend. <laughs>